Hi guys, welcome to another caveman science experiment. Uh, this time we are going to talk about headroom. Headroom in an amplifier. In front of me here I have a flower way, a vase um, full of water. Uh, and the water is the power that this amplifier has. This flower vase is an amplifier. Um, it's a small one. Um, Let's say it's a, you, you have a four to 500 watt speaker and right here you have a 50 to a 75 watt amplifier, okay? And the water is the wattage and the power that that amplifier can give um, under certain operational circumstances, okay? So let's say we start playing music and we turn the volume up really loud. To, we start gradually and then we turn it up and 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 you really want to rock out and you put on techno and the more you turn up the more you distress the amplifier and all of a sudden the amplifier goes totally out of power and that's when it starts to clip there's nothing more to to get from the amplifier it's out it is over its capacity and it starts to clip and you have no more power to get out of it that's what happens with small amplifiers now let's drain this water and let's let's take a look at this here i have a bigger amplifier this is a very powerful amplifier. Let's say you have the same four or 500 watt speakers. We can use Sir and Vega as a reference because they're efficient. They are powerful. They can take a lot of power. And a lot of people say that you don't need a big amplifier to drive them. Well, you want to create headroom. And the way you do that is that you use a big enough amplifier with a lot of juice in it. The water is the juice, it's the wattage. What happens with a big amplifier compared to a small one that goes out, there is nothing more to get. There is no more power. No more juice. Well, a big amplifier like this, when you start playing, it will give power. And it will keep on giving power. It doesn't matter how much you push it it keeps on giving and giving and giving there is no stopping you have created headroom which means when this sink overflows that will um, signal and tell us that the speakers have had enough so by using a very powerful amplifier that has abundance of juices to power your speakers your speakers are the ones who are going to give in first not your amplifier you don't run out of juice and you don't clip when you clip it's when the amplifier runs out of juice but if you have enough power enough juice you're not going to clip because you know you don't have to push it to this limit where it goes out so that is basically headroom explained in a caveman science.